The Kuznetsov NK25 is a three-shaft low-bypass afterburning turbofan engine that was developed by the Kuznetsov Design Bureau during the Soviet era in the early 1970s. The design work took place between 1972 and 1974. It is largely recognized for its usage in the Tupolev Tu-22M series strategic bomber, a supersonic aircraft that is highly capable. The NK-25 is one of the most potent Russian supersonic aircraft engines still in service, producing a maximum thrust of approximately 245 kilonewtons, which is about 55,000 pounds of force, with the afterburner. A four-stage axial turbine is paired with a three-stage low-pressure compressor, a five-stage intermediate pressure compressor, and a seven-stage high-pressure compressor in the engine's compressor configuration. It has an overall pressure ratio of approximately 25.9 and a bypass ratio of approximately 1.45. The thrust-to-weight ratio is nearly 7 and the turbine inlet temperature reaches approximately 1,597 kelvins, which is about 1,324 degrees Celsius, indicating its efficiency for its era. The NK-25 is more accurately described as an evolutionary development that succeeded the NK-22. The NK-22 is a two-shaft low-bypass afterburning turbofan that was used to power the Tupolev Tu-22M bomber in its earlier versions. It is capable of producing a maximum afterburning thrust of approximately 216 kilonewtons, or 48,500 pounds of force. The NK-22 is equipped with a three-stage turbine and a 12-stage axial compressor, resulting in a bypass ratio of approximately 0.6 and a pressure ratio of approximately 14.75. The NK-25 is a significant technological advancement, boasting improved pressure ratios, thrust, and overall performance. There are many noteworthy derivatives within the Kuznetsov engine family. The NK-3202 Series 2 is a modernized variant of the NK-32 engine, which was originally developed as a powerful afterburning three-spool turbofan that generated thrust levels of approximately 245 kilonewtons, or 55,000 pounds of force. The Tupolev Tu-160 strategic bomber, which is the largest and fastest supersonic bomber in service, is powered by the NK-32, the NK-3202 further refines the original by incorporating new compressor and turbine blade designs and enhanced cooling. This leads to greater fuel efficiency and an operational range that is approximately 1,000 kilometers, or about 620 miles. The PD-30 engine is a geared high-bypass turbofan that is derived from the NK-32, it is built to generate a thrust of approximately 290 kilonewtons, or about 30,000 kilogram force. This engine is being considered for powering an upgraded version of the Antonov 4 and 124 heavy transport aircraft, with a focus on enhanced fuel efficiency and fleet modernization. It is also intended for use in new Russian wide body airliners. The NK-65 is a non-afterburning variant that is presently being developed for the next-generation Russian strategic bomber project, known as PAC-DA. It is based on the NK-32 core. The NK-65 is designed to balance fuel economy with performance to provide a reliable and efficient propulsion system for this stealthy, long-range bomber. The NK-65 has been selected as the power plant for PAC-DA, and engine development is currently underway, according to official sources. The NK-34 is a turbojet engine that is designed for use in seaplanes. Although there is less comprehensive public information available regarding this engine, it is a component of Kuznetsov's broader strategy to equip specialized aircraft types. This plan aligns with Russia's pursuit of aviation assets that are adaptable and capable of operating in maritime environments. The NK-44 is a high-thrust turbofan engine that is reported to have a maximum thrust of approximately 400 to 450 kilonewtons. Although this engine was proposed for large aircraft, 
including the Ilyushin Il-96 widebody airliner, it did not achieve widespread production or service. It continues to be part of the Kuznetsov legacy, which involves developing robust, high-bypass turbofans for commercial and heavy transport applications. The Kuznetsov Design Bureau has a rich history, beginning with the development of engines such as the NK-12 turboprop, which were widely used from the 1950s onward and were renowned for their exceptional durability. Kuznetsov has developed a diverse range of aviation propulsion systems over several decades, including turboprops and turbofans, as well as rocket engines classified under the NK designation. Notable rocket motors include the NK-9, NK-15, and NK-33. This lineage showcases a continuous evolution in propulsion technology, with numerous engines demonstrating enhancements in efficiency, thermodynamics, and materials specifically designed for both military and civilian aircraft. In conclusion, the assessment of the NK-25 and its associated NK engine family members underscores Kuznetsov's substantial legacy of innovative, powerful propulsion solutions. The NK-25 is not merely a derivative of the NK-22, but rather a matured development of it. Its numerous derivatives, including the NK-3202, which is used to power strategic bombers, the PD-30, which is designed for future airliners, and the NK-65, which is specialized for next-generation military aircraft, serve as a testament to the continuous development of Russian aerospace propulsion. The NK-34 and NK-44 further demonstrate Kuznetsov's versatility in meeting a variety of aviation needs, including seaplanes and large commercial transports. Overall, Kuznetsov's contribution to the design of aero engines emphasizes its critical significance in the history of aerospace engineering in both the Soviet Union and Russia. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Also, please take our channel membership, which is very affordable, to encourage us.